It's Bonnie. Happy Wednesday evening. I am back. I can't believe it's dark out at 510. Oh my gosh. That's one thing I don't like about November. I hate when it gets dark early. I like it to be laid out later and now it's starting to snow. So what are we going to do? We're going to stay inside and we're going to talk about Bath and Body Works fun size sale, which is going on today only. $2.95. The lip gloss, the bath fizzies, the minis. This is a fabulous sale. I've been talking about it all day on my channel. And one thing I wanted to talk about is what is the difference between the hand cream and the body cream, because there's a clear difference in size here. Um, really interesting, actually. So Bath & Body Works um, is kind of famous for their hand creams. These have been around forever. I am not a personal fan of the lids, because especially when they're brand new, they can be a little bit tough um, to take off. And then like if you drop them, it's very difficult to find the lid Whereas the creams, they have a flip top. You're not gonna lose this lid, especially if you're like you're in the car. I can't tell you how many lids I've dropped under the seat of my car. So the hand creams are one ounce. And oh my gosh, I was a huge fan of hand creams for years. I would collect the hand creams. I had so much hand cream. I like the formula. It's very thick. Um, the fragrance is always good. I'm going to read the ingredients, or not the ingredients, but the main um, the main call-out ingredients in the hand cream. They are vitamin E, aloe, shea and cocoa butter, and hyaluronic acid. Then we have the Ultimate Hydration Body Cream. These are 2.5 ounces, so you're getting an extra ounce and a half in this one. Let me talk about the main ingredients. They are, where are they on the front of the back? I got to go on this because they don't have them on the back of the minis. Um, vitamin E, aloe, shea butter, cocoa butter, and hyaluronic acid. Um, exactly the same. These are identical in the call out ingredients and they both say 24 hour moisture it's interesting that they snuck the hyaluronic acid in um, the hand cream i didn't even realize that i'm like wow it's like the same thing so i want to show you on my hand um the difference so neither one of these come out very um quickly uh you know remember i did the uh, body lotion the other day and it kind of drips out the hand cream um is fairly thick it comes out um like this, you can kind of see it on my hand, uh, and it's a very thick cream. Here's the mini. I'm gonna show you how this one comes out. It's a, a little bit thinner, just a little, not that much though. So I'm gonna put this one on my hand. So if I had to guess, I would say in the hand cream, um, there is a little bit more of, um, the shea cocoa butter, and that's thickening it up. It's more of like a super thick, almost like a body butter, um, where I feel like the body cream is a lot slipperier, and um, maybe it has a little bit more aloe vitamin E in it. I mean, there's a clear difference in the formula. Um, the cream is definitely slicker, even though it comes out slower than the body lotion, and the hand cream it's just really, really thick. I mean, this just, you can just layer it on um, and it's gonna give you really good coverage. So the question at hand, I'm just gonna rub both of these together now. <laughs> I've actually tested these out pretty extensively um, in the last day or two, because I was planning on doing this video. Um, it kind of smells good. <laughs> When you mix together rainbow swirl candy and winter candy apple, I'm like, I think I just created a new scent. It's like winter candy candy apple. <laughs> it's, it's actually pretty good. Um, so if you're someone who has really dry, cracked red hands in the winter, I would suggest getting the hand cream uh, because it does give like a thicker coverage. I am actually extremely lucky in that my hands um, don't dry out very much. Like in the winter, they start to like, um, I'm in water a little bit more. They do dry out a little bit and I'll, you know, I'll put a little bit of hand cream on and stuff. 
Uh, and it does. It does a really good job um, moisturizing. However, I almost feel like you're getting pretty decent coverage uh, with the body cream. The thing you might not like with the body cream is it's a little bit um, gooier when it goes on. And if you're, you know, putting it on in the car or something, um, you might notice if it doesn't sink in right away that your hand feels a little bit stickier. Whereas I feel like the hand cream dries really quickly and you don't get that um, kind of gooey stickiness that you do uh, with the body cream. Because the body cream you're going to put on like after a shower or something and it's going to have a chance to absorb. Whereas the hand cream, like I said, you're out and about, you want to grab a little hand cream, you put it on and you get more of a, um, a smoothness, like a dryness with the hand cream. There is no wrong answer here. I have actually used both of these um, as a hand cream. I do keep um, one of the Ultimate Hydration Body Creams in my purse, and I usually always have a hand cream in my purse. That way, like if I'm out and about and it's winter and my hands just feel like they're getting really dry, um, I'll put a little bit on. Mostly it depends on like which scent I feel like wearing um, or if I'm in a hurry. Like I said, I like that I can just flip the top on this. I usually use a little bit less of the body cream on my hands because a little dab goes a long way. I mean, I'll have to say, don't put too much on because then you're going to have sticky hands and that's not fun when you're driving. Um, again, it's a little bit harder to get the lid off um, of the hand cream, but again, you don't really need that much. I mean, a little tiny dab will work. Um, so the, the one ounce bottle does, you know, it, it goes a while. I'll have to say that. I mean, even though it's a small bottle or small tube, um, it's going to last you a while. So it kind of just depends on your preference, but they're kind of essentially the same formula. I think just the ingredients are weighted slightly different. So today, today is definitely the day to buy both of these in the mini size. I would never consider carrying one of these in my purse. These are too clunky. So my two choices for hand cream um, in my purse are definitely the minis. They're both $2.95 today. The retail on the cream is $8.50. The retail on the hand cream is $8.50. So it's the same price. Um, you're just getting a little bit more product in the cream than you are the hand cream. But um, both, you know, both of them are super popular. Oops, this is upside down. <laughs> there we go. They're both super popular and both of them make amazing gifts. So um, either way you go, you're gonna win, seriously. So anyway, um, let me know what you think. I'm curious to know uh, how everyone feels about the hand cream versus the body cream. Do you use the body cream on your hands? Um, do you prefer one formula over the other? Um, like I said, I like them both. They're, they're, they're nice. I just don't buy these very often because they're pricey. Uh, but today is the day to buy them because they're $2.95. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.